So I'm out here during prayer time reading The Holy Spirit and His Gifts by Kenny B. Hagan. And there's a chapter called The Ten Reasons Why Every Believer Should Speak in Tongues. And as I'm reading these underlying parts, I'm kind of blown away because I mean, as you read some of these lines, so to assist us in the worship of God, speaking in tongues, it's a flowing stream that should never dry up. And for he that speaketh in any unknown tongue speaketh not unto men, but unto God. And so I'm sitting here thinking like, how often are we speaking to men about our dreams? the visions that God has given us are calling our purpose and we're speaking to men when we should really be speaking to God sharing those divine secrets with God and it talks about that in 1 Corinthians 14 2 and it states that he is talking of divine secrets in the spirit God has given to the church a divine supernatural means of communication with him and this basically says when you pray in tongues your spirit is in direct contact with God you have a direct line to him no holding no transfer a direct line direct contact direct communication with God supernaturally at that so when you speak in tongues you are talking to him by divine supernatural means And we have continual awareness of the Holy Spirit's indwelling presence and of this divine communication and divine secrets in the Spirit. And we have access, access to God all the time. Direct contact, you have his direct line.